Okay, because we could have gone to Wikibuy and Wikibuy found it for one thirty nine. Oh, why didn't you tell me that? Hello. And welcome to another day. Anyway, want to know what we're doing? Audience, <laughs> I need participation. Oh, what are we doing? Oh, I'm glad you asked. Um, uh, we are going on a parents' night out. So, very much needed. I'm losing my mind. Are you, sir? Yes. That was a nod. Uh, in confirmation. So, we are losing our minds a little bit. Uh, it just, you know, we usually do staycations with the kids. As you know, we went to Vegas. Mm, we just did another staycation at a hotel. Like a few days ago, really nice pool. And that's kind of what we're asking is every time we call, we're like, hey, what's the pool situation? And um, and we could use it. So we did the same thing now and we got a babysitter. So we are going to stay the night away. And it's just nice to be at a hotel where we can watch whatever we want. We can go to the pool whenever we want. We don't have little kids asking us like, can we go to the pool and stay forever? And I don't want to go home and um, X, Y, and Z. If you're a parent, you know what I'm talking about you know, uh, or interruptions of like finally getting to the pool with all your stuff. And then I gotta go pee or I'm hungry. Anyway, so it's just nice. So we're gonna get a little getaway and that is what we're doing. We are driving to that hotel and it looks so nice. Like the pool is huge and it has like a little beach, you know, like a waiting area where you like walk into it. And then the beach, like the ocean is, like you can see it I think from the pictures that we saw it's right in front of the, the hotel. So we got our swimsuits and we are so excited. And honestly, we're so exhausted that like, I mean, I just, I wanna just be able to watch a movie in silence and also just to sleep for longer than five or 6 a.m. because that's usually when Balian wakes me up. <coughs> um, anyway, so that's what we're doing. We'll check out the room when we get there. That's it. But first, we're gonna eat. It's a new place in Vista, so we'll see how it goes. Okay, y'all. So, as you can see, that food was bomb.com if you're in Vista, California. I would stop at a Coolichi town. Um, we were pleasantly surprised. The one thing I will say that I did not dig too much was the, the prawns, which was the cucumbers with the prawns in the middle. 
the flavoring wasn't to my liking and I think it was hard to eat that right after the aguachiles. But the last thing we got was also like aguachiles and that was... So not bomb. doing complimentary breakfast. Uh, please hold. <laughs> Maybe you should be a part of this. No, they said that they don't offer me complimentary breakfast. And that was my fear that whatever web that website <laughs> said there, it was messed up because... Okay, get to the part where they said, here's your credit back because obviously we paid for a service. They're, that... they're not going to... Why not? Because they're not offering any, any packet. Then we need our money back. We specifically picked that packet because it was including two breakfasts. Yes, but they're not. They they don't usually. They would. That's what they would do. But due to the the current thing, they don't. They don't. I understand. Them. I want my money back. I want like they're, a credit. They're not going to give. Okay, because we could have gone to Wikibuy and Wikibuy found it for one thirty nine. Oh, why didn't you tell me that? I'm telling you now. So we need to talk to the manager when we get to our room, unless you ask for your money back right now and. You can go where else? Somewhere else. Or what? What happened? Did you get the keys or yes. not? Oh, I thought you like were taking a stand. And we're back. Um, okay, so basically as far as the food, like I said, I didn't like the flavoring of the middle plate with the prawns. It, it was like this tomato Valentina type base mm -hmm. sauce. Yeah. And that is really hard. Oh, okay. And that is really hard to... Um, to kind of take after the aguachiles because aguachiles is more of a fresh flavor more fresh lime so yeah call me karen because i'll be talking to the manager <laughs> so we've arrived let's get up ready yeah And that is how it's done, ladies and gents. So, lighting is horrible, but um, I just wanted to update you because um, I know we brought you guys along just to see like the mini vacation, the parental mini vacation staycation um it has been interesting so we chose the place because they have a great pool we didn't go to the pool apparently they closed kind of early um and then a couple things happened so we had picked the room this is just i feel like all of this encompasses like 2020 right a little bit of a crap show so um, we check in and I had specifically chosen the like this deal or whatever uh, because it included two breakfasts for two adults. Excuse me. Um, and when we checked in, they were like, oh, no, we, we don't have any, you know, we're not giving any breakfast or anything. So, of course, I'm a little upset, which I guess at this point, I'm sure you probably heard a little bit of that. Um, and so that was a bummer, right? Because we obviously paid for this thing. I mean, even if they weren't going to do a sit down thing, you know, I was expecting like a to go breakfast. They do have restaurants open. And, um, I think as of this week, they were starting to open more things. Like I, I drove by a salon. It was open. A couple ones were open. The nail places were open. So like things are happening this week. So upset strike number one. So then we get to the room and I think everything looks really nice. 
Uh, and then we leave to just get some dessert and some coffee, come back, I go to put the, dis the like, you know, do not disturb sign on the door. And then, <laughs> why are you laughing at my pain? <laughs> The way you're telling it. What do you mean the way I'm telling it? The way it? you're telling it. Hey, I, I go and go and put the sign on the door. Are you done, sir? <laughs> do you have to say that? Say what? I have to put the sign. <laughs> what do you mean? Oh, my God. <laughs> Anyways, um, so I went to go put the sign on the door and the freaking door, which was like a, a ton, it weighs a ton. It's so heavy. This is what happened. Matter of fact, it got both of these. Okay. But this one was like more of a victim. This one was a supporting finger. It got both of them. Um, it basically shut on my hand. Like it was closing, closing, closing. And at the very end, the little sucker just bam, it just, it took my fingers out. I couldn't feel, I still can't feel much of this one. Like I can't feel anything. And I know so I'm nervous because you never scream for pain or throw yourself on the bed <laughs> for pain. I mean, if you get hurt, you're like, oh, and you know, walk away. I've only had children with no epidural, so. But when you threw yourself on the, I was like, oh, shoot, this is serious. Um, it was kind of serious. So I had a water bottle in my hand, and I was, like, trying to hold it, but my hand was like, <laughs> will you stop? Okay, <laughs> it wasn't funny, but, and I was like, <laughs> and so I, like, turned, and I dropped the water bottle, and he was like, what is, he goes, what happened, Lindsay? And I was like, <laughs> Why do you threaten my life like that? Using first name basis? Anyway, so I like threw the water bottle down, came to the bed and I was like, uh, uh, you know, when you're in pain and you just do the whole zombie, like rocking back and forth thing, threw myself in the bed and he's like, we need ice, you know? And um, nurse Alex tries to, <laughs> tries to go get ice in the ice bucket. And I'm like sitting here in pain and he's taking his good old time. That's what I'm thinking from my perspective. He eventually comes back as my fingers are like, you know, and he's like, oh, I walked down and we're like in the middle. I don't know why, what our luck is. I think I talked about this in the Vegas video. They always be putting our families like at the end of a hallway or in the middle. So we're far from the, you know, elevator. And so he goes to one end and there's no ice. Then he comes back. Then he goes to the other end and there's ice. And eventually he makes his way here. Ugh, I, um... I have been in really bad pain. I mean, I was mostly quiet after a while, um, just laying on it. I had grabbed that water bottle that we had just bought and I was like putting my little fingers on it. Um, I will insert a picture of it right at the beginning, either picture or video, right at the beginning, right when he eventually did get me that bag of ice. And then like an hour or two later, and then this is, you know, several hours later, like it's one in the morning and this happened like around seven or 8 PM. I mean, it, I've never seen my nail like that. Anyway, uh, yeah, it feels weird. And of course I'm freaking out that this door damaged some nerves because I, you know, like when your leg falls asleep, it feels like that, but like it's been hours and I don't feel anything. So he gave me Advil, which I don't believe in. I feel like most of the time when I have a headache or something, it never works. Um, he thinks that it definitely helped because it's like, it's okay. It, it's numb. It hurts faintly, but it's all right. But I'm worried. And it got some of this one too. This one feels better right now, but this one, it's just terrible. Anyway, so then there was that. Then, this is so like, I don't know. I just, the place looks nice. But I'm like ready to, you know, throw some hands. Like, how are you going to have a door that does that? It could have severed a child's hand. Severed, okay? Alex was saying like it's a new hotel and it's supposed to do that for safety. But we go to a lot of hotels for staycations and the door just, you know, slowly. Or it doesn't slam like that. I don't know. I just feel like mm, this door, it's, it's, it, thank God it wasn't a child. I'm telling you. I almost thought my hand was severed, but 
anyway, regardless. So then the toilet is stopped up, okay? <laughs> I don't know what is going on. Uh, and we call and we're like, well, we try to give it a minute, you know, so it just like unclogs on its own. And it doesn't. So then we call downstairs and we're like, hey, can we get some help? And they're like, um, the people that do that are not working or something. They're off. They're off. They don't come back until tomorrow, 6 a.m. This is a Hilton, isn't it? Yes. I believe this is a Hilton. Pretty sure this is a Hilton. It's a fancy resort and spa type of place. I don't understand. So he's like, well, can I get a plunger? You know, because I'll do it, whatever. They bring the plunger. All right, cool. Strike like three or four? I'm just fine. Probably strike three. Um, and then I feel like there's a long list. That list alone was a long one. Oh, the couch. <laughs> Again, everything looks nice. The shower's super cool. But the couch, you sit on it because it's like, okay, we got the TV. We're going to watch a movie. And you barely sit on it. And it's like, it's like burping at every movement, you know, like. <sighs> I don't understand, Hilton family. I mean, we, we paying y'all good coins. So it'd be nice to, you know, have a couple things going right. Throw us a couple bones, maybe a couple cereal boxes with milk for the breakfast. I don't know. But... It's just weird. With that being said, I feel like, I feel like there's gonna be more. I hope not. But, you know, you just never know. So that's the update for today, day one. We're only gonna be here one night, but it's just nice to decompress. So far, we have been doing that and it's been nice, but you know, I've got a throbbing, non-feeling finger trying to type like you know doing my best anyway that's it for this evening we will see you guys in the morning okay guys and this is the restroom that i didn't show yesterday and it's beautiful i feel like it's a good size the floor dips a little bit it's very nice bam and that is how you almost sever a finger or lose a nail. And from the other side. Out of nowhere it hits you. All right.